Um, you know, I think that uh, we, I mean, well, we finished our drives, right? We converted our third downs. We, uh, you know, we were efficient running the football. We protected. It was guys were winning on their routes. Everyone did their job. And when everyone does their job, we can score points. So um, I credit it to a lot of things. Oh man, I th I'm sure he was super pumped. You know, um, uh, you know, he did a great job. Him and JJ were splitting that play all week, so I guess they rock paper scissored uh, to see if who was going to play, but um, and got it. But I'm happy for him. It was awesome. Such a big play. So uh, I know he was pumped. I know you guys have to win, obviously, but how can you guys improve from this game going forward, all around on offense? Oh, we can always improve, w win or lose. You know, there again, there's so many things that happen in a game. You hear all the time, it's all about the details. And we'll watch the film. There's a couple plays that should have been even bigger plays, to be honest with you. Uh, you know, certain coverages they played, certain things, certain looks. Um, there, there's a lot of meat on that bone out there, you know, that uh, we felt bad as an offense for our defense. We shouldn't have, you know, had it that close for them. It's huge. You know, that's the main thing we said on the sideline. We got to go get points. Um, you know, we have to go get points. We got to, you know, when you can take the clock away, awesome. You know, and we, we were able to do that. And that, that happens by, you know, finishing drives, finishing on third down, finishing on a, a fourth and, what was it, fourth and one and a half? <laughs> it was a long fourth and one, right? Um, you know, that was, uh, that was a big time. There's a whole bunch of big time plays in there, but uh, had a lot of, a lot of long drives. A lot of sustained drives, and it happens when everyone's just on on doing their assignment. Everyone's on the same page, and that's what can happen. The person who touched down to Moreau and said he was not the primary. Mm -mm. He's a four, and a fourth round draft pick and a rookie, and it was a contested play. You gave him a shot. Yep. What yep. Has he shown you to, to earn that? You know, it's so funny. We called that play in practice during training camp, and. Uh, you know, he's definitely not the primary. Um, and uh, the way that our defense played it, he ended up getting the ball and it was a touchdown. And we didn't even think twice about that. You're like, oh, well, that's an anomaly. That'll never happen again, right? And sure enough, we come back, drop back, and the safety's looking at me. And obviously, I would cheat towards Waller also. Um, and uh, he cheated towards Waller just enough to give me a throw to Foster. And Foster was able to get his first touchdown, which is, I mean, that's always exciting. He's probably super pumped right now. Yeah. How key was that in this game and just for the offensive uh, development? Very key. Um, we knew coming into this game it was going to be uh, a very balanced game plan. Uh, you have to be able to, against this defense, run it and throw it. Um, and when you throw it, you got to hit them. You know, it's one of those games. And, uh, you know, we were able to run the ball efficiently. Uh, we were able to pass the ball very efficiently. Um, and with even with a few that we could have had make an even bigger place, right? Uh, and so we'll take a look at those and correct those. But overall, you sit back and look, and it was very balanced. And that's what we said coming in. We had to be very balanced, had to run it. You know, even if they were going to blitz into certain looks and things like that, we had Coach Cable did a great job with his calls, Rodney seeing it, making the calls versus certain looks. And we were able to run it, especially at the end, right? Like everyone's high fiving, we're up two touchdowns. But when you take a look back, they got three timeouts, and we need a first down, you know, when you don't want to give them the ball back. So they knew we were running it. And our offensive line was still able to move people. You know, I'm not. I'm not surprised. I mean, he's first round pick, right? <laughs> he's first round pick. You know, you expect a lot out of that, especially out of that school that he came from. They they happen to win a lot of championships there, and so you know they had some good running backs in the past too. So uh, you watch him run the football, and he's always finishing with his pads about that high off the ground. And as a as a linebacker, as a defensive player, it's hard it's hard to get a solid hit on him, you know. And he's, uh, I think, what we saw today, even on the little scramble drill check down, where he was over the ball, and we saw his agility too. He's not just a power guy; like he he really can do it all. And so, um, one thing it, it hasn't surprised me. I just have learned about him. Is I, what I love is he doesn't care what the situation is. He 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 thinks that he can pretty much score every time he gets the ball. And so, uh, you know, when, he, when he, even when he's getting hit hard and. Running back, I'll tell you, is the hardest physical position to play in all sports. You know, I, I sit there and I watch these guys, what they go through, and it's ridiculous, right? So my kids won't play running back. But 
I'm glad that we have Josh because he kind of likes it, you know. He, he kind of gets excited about it and you know, wants to take the punishment to him even if they do stick him one time. But, uh, I mean, I'm just trying to tell you all the special things about the kid. I mean, I love him. You know, he does, does a great job in pass protection, and uh, I think that's my favorite part. Oh man, yeah. It because uh, you know we knew that that was just that's on us. Me and Josh, we got to clean that up. We we're like, it wasn't nothing that someone did to stop us. That's completely on us. We put our defense in a bad spot, and we were like, man, all, all we kept thinking about was like, we got to go get that touchdown back for him, you know. And I remember we actually scored the next time, and I went and told Vontez, we got it back for you. <laughs> um, but yeah, we put our. You all right? No, okay. I'm making sure y'all y'all's feet are okay. Um, but but. Uh, we messed that up. You know, it wasn't like, oh, dang, what was that look or what was that blitz? Like, dang, you know, they hit us in the mouth. Um, you know, it was one of those plays that uh, we messed it up, and you know, I'll make sure I, you know, I'll make sure that I do better for him next time. That makes it easier to correct your own. One hundred percent. You know, and when it when it's something you can control, then it's way easier. On the on the touchdown. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, so we saw, you know, on film. Just evidence that it, you know, it could be a big play. You know, uh, actually, we seen, you know, we saw a team running against them, you know, a few years, you know, a while back, and uh, you know, it was like, oh man, this could be a, this could be a big play for us. And coach put it in, and uh, in practice, everything looks good, right? You know, you're like, oh man, this is awesome. Uh, you know, and you, we put it in, and uh, we didn't know who it was going to be though. You know, on the team, we thought JJ ran it in practice. Uh, you know, obviously Trevor ran it in practice. Um, but Trevor got it today, and we knew he had the speed, and Coach told him, like, he told him the night before, whoever gets this thing, because we didn't know if J.J. was going to play, you know, and he's like, whoever gets this thing, I want to see 4-2 speed, you know, after that, after you get the ball, and I think we saw it, man, that guy, he took off, and that was it. Oh, yeah. I mean, I think we all know that, right? He's super athletic, you know, the way he can he can run and pull and do all those things. It's really impressive to be, what is he, 6'8", you know, 3 plus, you know, that, that's that's ridiculous. I mean, that's what we're dealing with in the NFL, right? It's ridiculous to see him that far down the field too running like that. That's crazy. I think, I think he deserves a game ball for that one for sure. So you had one. Go ahead. <laughs> yeah. I felt bad for our O line. Felt like we were just, you know, running guys through. You know, everyone kept getting banged up for a little bit, and then obviously with Devi, you know, getting hurt, good coming in. But uh, you know, it's when when Sharp came in, you know, his the look in his eye was different. You know, he, you know, he 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 looked ready to go. You know, and uh, you know he he's he's super talented. We all know how talented the guy is, and so. Uh, for it to click and for him to come in and play well and block some pretty good rushers that they have, uh, and, and to you know move people in the run game, I thought he did a great job. Last one. When you, uh, when you see Davis making plays like that in the running game, does it get you excited to try to see what he can do in the passing game for you guys? Oh yeah, especially in the future. You know, obviously, you know, you get a guy. What is it? Eight, eight, nine days ago. You know, he's probably not going to be featured. You know, in the past game. You know, that's a little bit different timing and stuff. Um, but now that he's been around, he showed that he can make plays. Now you can, you know, like you're kind of excited, like, oh man, what else can we do with him? Kind of a thing. Uh, but yeah, you know, it was, you know, definitely heavily. We're always going to be heavily trying to get, you know, Waller and Tyrell our running backs and Renfro the ball. But you know, for a new guy, you know, he didn't have very many mistakes. Um, the ones he did are easy to correct. So uh, when it comes to the pass game, he could be a, a big weapon for us. Thanks, guys. Thanks.